Hey everyone, how's it going? I'm finally back from tour. And let me tell you, that was a wild ride. <laughs> I joined Kamasi Washington and his band on this tour all across Europe and Asia. For a month we traveled all over the world playing in front of thousands and thousands of people. It was really special to see so many people be into music where you have a saxophone and a trombone and an upright bass, and you see people kind of rocking out to that stuff. It's not something I'm used to seeing very often in this world anymore. So I think that's a really positive thing. The first part of the trip was Europe, and we basically lived on a tour bus together. The tour bus was our home, that's where we ate, that's where we slept, that's where we hung out, and it took us all across Europe from country to country to country. A really good show in Dublin today. In a couple of the trips, we had to get our bus on a huge boat and travel on the boat with our bus on it. Like for instance, when we went from England to Ireland. I don't know if you know this, but when it comes to touring, music is actually a very small part of it. You're only on stage an hour and a half a day or every other day. Most of the other time, you just hang out, laugh, eat, fly, and you and the band basically live together like a family for the duration of the tour. You're looking at me, man. I'm, I'm, hey, man, I'm the man with the soul, the man with the bones. Give it to you, but I'll probably take it all day long. Oh, hey, man. <laughs> Now it's a huge sounding band, so I had to upgrade my gear, add a bunch of pedals to my keyboards and get a clavinet and a guitar amp to run the clavinet through and like a wah-wah pedal and overdrive pedal and delay pedals and just, I had to match the sound and the sort of the power of the sound of the band. This band has two drummers in it. <laughs> And playing with these guys is like, it's like you get hit by a wall of rhythm and a wall of sound. Like they're all jazz musicians, but they play this jazz music, I don't know, like it's hip hop or something. They play it with such attitude and with such heart that people just get it, you know? <laughs> Thousands of people cheering onto a freaking trombone solo, you know? When's the last time you saw something like that happen? So I think that's actually really incredible. We traveled a lot and we tried all kinds of foods and we met all kinds of people and we played for all kinds of audiences. And it's really crazy to see how people everywhere respond to such similar things, you know? Like, people love music everywhere. People feel energy in the music. And it's really cool to see how that sort of transcends culture and really kind of appeals to people on a more fundamental level. Yeah, <laughs> 
have some more touring coming up. I'm going on tour with the guitar player Larry Carlton. So that's going to be exciting. I think Bob Reynolds is joining us on saxophone. And Gary Novak is going to be on drums. And Travis Carlton, who's a really great bass player, is going to play bass. So looking forward to that. And then right after, I'm joining the great vocalist Shoshana Bean for a quick run in the States. Shoshana is a big and famous Broadway girl that decided that she wants more out of life and now has a successful solo career of her own outside of Broadway and she's touring the States and she's one of the best singers I've probably ever played with and I've played with some great singers. So that's gonna be a ton of fun. And then after Shoshana's run, I think my touring will be done for the year. I'm probably gonna be a little tired by that point since I've been touring nonstop since June, starting with Bob Reynolds' group all the way until now and still going. But I'm very happy I get to meet a lot of you guys and talk to a lot of you in person. If you'd like to come with me on my journey, follow me on Instagram at Ruslan Piano. I constantly post short little vlogs from every country I go to, pictures and videos of me playing and all kinds of cool stuff. So pop up on there and find me. And also, like, how many of you guys are actually professional musicians? I'm really curious. Has any of you guys had any experience touring or maybe even touring locally in your state? And what are your thoughts on that? I'm going to make a whole vlog on touring and what I think about touring in general. I've, at this point, done a lot of it and I have some pretty well-formed opinions on it <laughs> for myself. Well, that's about it, you guys. I'm going to be posting a lot more music lessons on this channel and some more vlogs, as well as all the stuff on Instagram. So hit that like button and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.